real I contemplate that how I feel But you make it way too hard to think Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. We're here with another video and in today's video I will be using my 3XL square no c-curve tips from bomb nails Also my bomb nail size 14 Kalinsky brush I will also be using a birthday suit one of my favorite cover colors y'all Cedar um, this is from the new fall collection. I will also be using heartbreak. Look at the new I love it the new aesthetic I'll also be using heartbreaker from last year's Valentine's Day collection And I didn't show autumn gems number four only because I didn't use that in the set I thought I was going to use that in the set, but I didn't um, so I didn't show that um, So here we go y'all. This is one of the um, colors um, that people weren't or didn't really care for on um, the swatch video and honestly I think this is a very like unique um very pretty color actually um and I got this inspiration um the same place I got that inspiration I did on freestyle friday with the brown and the pink um from my Uggs y'all I have like 30 pairs of Uggs I love Uggs I take really good care of my Uggs y'all um and they just gave me inspiration because a lot of my Uggs are this color tan with the pink on the side or, you know, so that's where I got inspiration from. This actually came out really pretty and, uh, well, I thought it did. It came out really pretty. Um, and also, um, yeah, I just love this color. I think it's a very unique, subtle, uh, very fally color mixed with the pink. It went really well together. Um... Yeah, so, and I knew that because, like I said, I have Uggs this color, and they go with, like, uh, you'd be surprised how many colors this color actually goes with. So, this is Cedar, y'all, from the new Fall Collection. As y'all know, everything Bomb Nails on my channel will be linked in the description below. We also have a 15% discount code. If there's anybody new, welcome. Um, Bomb Nails is a beautiful, beautiful company, beautiful product. I swear by this product. I love this product, y'all. And the cover color, I finally got to open my new four ounce, y'all. So I was really excited about that. We won't be doing any nail art in today's video. It's just capping and um, doing this marble. This marble was so pretty, y'all. I really, I really do enjoy these marbles with like the darker um, browns. Uh, I wish on my Freestyle Friday set... Um, I wouldn't have went in with any other color besides the uh, the um, marble with the brown and the pink. And I think I'm going to redo that set over um, and show y'all actually what I was thinking about. But sometimes y'all, when I come up with inspirations that are my own, sometimes I get carried away because I always think of extra stuff to put in. When in fact, just the regular marble itself would just be beautiful by itself. Um, even this set, I put glitter in it. It would have just been beautiful without glitter, but I think the glitter did make it look... Sorry, y'all. I had a phone call come in. So I think the glitter did make it look um, extra pretty, but it could have... It didn't need it, you know? It could have just been this marble. Um, so anyway, y'all, without further ado, we're going to get into the application. Again, if you're new welcome 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 to my channel make sure you comment interact with all the girls um this is a nice little nail community we love to talk to people we also have freestyle friday y'all if y'all were not there for last freestyle friday i know a lot of people couldn't make it for different reasons y'all it was so that was so funny y'all like i had such a good time with um miss k uh, Cynthia and Rachel it, and I think Eileen was there for a while yo it was so funny y'all like yo <laughs> like the nails like I was trying to go somewhere with those nails but I wound up again my mind just yeah we're gonna try those differently I have another idea for the splats and I'm not gonna do it on every nail y'all <laughs> okay but anyway without further ado y'all thank y'all for all your support I'm not gonna blather any further i'm gonna let y'all enjoy this application i love y'all thank you for again for all the support um and i will be back y'all i will be back
Thank you.
Hey y'all, I'm back. So this is what we're look like. We're we're look like. <laughs> we're looking like so far. So right now, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go ahead, um, cap these up, add a little bit of this uh, iridescent glitter to it, which I should have just left it alone. I don't know why I always gotta add glitter to something, but glitter makes everything beautiful, guys. So screw it. <laughs> no, but uh, I'm gonna add these little uh, iridescent. I got these from Secret Nail Affair in their Christmas box, mystery box last year. Um, and they were, I pulled most of the snowflakes out, but y'all, the, the snowflakes in this were real. I don't, I don't, I haven't gotten all of them out, but I got a good amount of them out and I saved them, um, for Christmas, you know, cause they're iridescent and they're beautiful. So they'll go good in some nails. So I did save those. We don't want to put anything to waste. Um, and that's what I'm going to do for all five fingers, y'all. And then I'm going to go in an ombre. I don't know if, if it's, I haven't ombre in a long time, y'all. And I've been doing, um, a lot more acrylic Frenchies than ombres, but y'all, I had to skip over my whole pointer finger because the application was so horrendous, y'all. So I'm like, all right, we're not going to put that in there. It was like giving flooding cuticles and like, it was just doing too much. And I just don't understand. Actually, I know why. I'll tell you why, y'all. My goal in this video was to finish the video faster than I usually do because you do, um, over time, want to get nice with your timing you don't want to have to spend i sit back and do videos for about four or five hours just as long as our lives um and i break it down i take my little breaks and stuff in between but i break my videos down so when i if i do something like this i'll do the marble first and i'll cut and then i'll, I'll do everything in steps y'all they're all separate videos that get put together um and that's because i like to take my little breaks i can't fully sit and go through a whole set like without taking a little break and that's because I'm on my time so with this video I tried to um speed it up a little bit see where I got now where I got was yes I got done a lot earlier but there was a lot less to cut out of my video you know what I'm saying I wasn't diddle daddling so my video was actually um usually there are about two and a half uh, so many hours that I have to break down this one or more could be like mostly they're like three hours that I have to break down all right so this one was an hour and 15 minutes that I had to break down. So it really doesn't matter. Like, I, I don't think it matters because I still, I mean, I got under an hour, which is, which is progress, but it still don't matter because now I have a lot less to take out of my videos. It just made the editing better. You know what I'm saying? It just made the hassle of cutting stuff out of my videos easier. It didn't actually chop my video down any. In order to chop my video down, I'd have to do a, what people do where is they'll do the first like three nails and then they'll be like oh i'm gonna do this to all five fingers and then just cut and not show y'all any so of the rest of the hand and i like to show the whole process this is um this is something that i love to do and i refuse to do that so yeah we're just gonna keep having um working on time working on um you know just finishing a little bit faster because I, technically i want my goal is to get my videos to anywhere between 35 minutes to 40 minutes with sh with showing y'all everything that's just a personal goal of mine um and that's what I'm going to try to accomplish over time y'all I've been here on YouTube a year I've been doing nails for about two years now um yeah so you know I'm excited um so now we're gonna go in I had cat so I went over again with one more thing of clear just to cap those um what are they called? The little iridescent flakes into place. I didn't show that because more time. Uh, but y'all, so I ca I did go over again and cap them. So it wasn't in my um my uh, birthday suit when I went to ombre. But y'all, that pointer finger, I don't know what was going on. Uh, I have to set my beads. When I do my um cuticle, I have to set my beads a little bit lower and push it back. Whereas I'll sit it like right next to it and then it'll just go everywhere. So I'm working on that. But yeah, I felt like I had a little bit of trouble with ombres last night, y'all. And, or a couple nights ago, I didn't do this last night. I think I did this like Sunday night. Um, but yeah, I did. I had a little bit of trouble and that's because I've been doing a lot more acrylic Frenchies. Um, yeah. So you see how close I put it to the cuticle where if it is going to run, there's nowhere for it to run. It'll just flood my cuticle. I gotta, I gotta work and I know better because I know, you know what I'm saying? Like I do know. Uh, so it's not like it's just something that I don't know. 
whatever we're gonna work on that too but yeah i feel like i had a little bit of trouble with ombres y'all but not too bad uh we did get it i think these looked beautiful one of my biggest problems with ombres is not ombre not the actual ombre bringing my ombre too far down because if you watch people do ombres they don't ever swipe down the whole nail they'll just swipe kind of like you're making an apex they'll swipe that little bottom piece down but they won't go down the whole nail my problem is wanting to swipe it down the whole nail so the cover the color will come down more um and i've been remedying that so uh yeah so these came out fire regardless i'm proud of myself i'm proud of my work i have come so far um on the this platform and just in nails in general if you all go back to my old videos you can just see the the progression in my application and um that's with help and tips and you know just practicing one thing about this is y'all don't give up too easy um practice that's all you have to do is practice don't take your time practice make quality content it's not a it's not a rush people are gonna like who they like and watch who they watch um, people are if they like shorter videos, they'll watch shorter videos if they like longer videos They'll watch longer videos. Most people I know um, Do like a little bit of a longer video um, So yeah, I just you know, I just do me y'all um, Has nothing to do with being like Well, I'm slow. I am I am slow. I like to take my time And I like to do quality quality work, you know Anyway, y'all, watch the rest of this application. There's no nail art or anything, so I won't be back, y'all. Um, I love y'all. I want to get this video out to you. I'm a little bit late again this week. Um, I'll be putting it out tomorrow, which is Thursday, um, right before Freestyle Friday. I meant to put this out today, y'all, but my kid, my son's been sick, so I've been tending to him, and I've also been doing my work at home while he's sick. Thank God they're not today they didn't, but tomorrow hopefully they'll let me you know, finish out my, um, week at home because it doesn't make much sense not to, you know what I'm saying? Like my old bureau, um, if your kid was sick, especially during like COVID times, if your child was sick, they would let you work from home while they were sick because at, they have to stay home from school. Um, and we're able to work from home. We have that luxury to work from home. So why not? You know what I'm saying? Why you waste your time when you can work from home? I work from home part time. So the days that I have to be in the office, if something does happen with a child, my old bureau lets you. I don't know why this one doesn't. So Tuesday, I was able to work from home. And then today, I had to call out for whatever reason. And then tomorrow, he's still, I can't send him to school like that. I refuse to. I don't send sick kids to school to get everybody else sick. Some parents may do that because of their jobs, but I don't. I let my kids stay home, recover. I'm not pushing them back to work. My kids come over any job. You know what I'm saying? I'm a hustler. I make money. And you know what I'm saying? Regardless. So my kids always come before my jobs. I know people don't always have the luxury of that. They literally have to do what they have to do with their kids. But I don't. I don't I don't care. I'm going to stay home. I'm going to let my kid feel better. And I'm not going to send them to school sick. So that's where we're at right now. I'm pretty sure I'll be able to work from home tomorrow. But if not, I got the time. You know what I'm saying? Um, so, yeah, let's watch. Maybe I'll be back. Maybe I'll be back. Because, um... I did have something to say, a story time, y'all, but maybe I'll save that for my next video. Um, so, yeah, enjoy the nails, y'all. I love y'all. Thank you for all your support and love. Thank you for everybody who stuck with me last Freestyle Friday. We were on till like, 1.30 a.m. We had a blast. It was such a good time, y'all. Thank you, Cynthia, Rachel, Eileen, all the girls that rocked out. Uh, y'all were amazing. I think Tanya's Nails was there for a mad long, too. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart um, for staying with me and not leaving me alone because we were we were doing a lot. Oh, Miss K, Miss K stayed too. Thank y'all so freaking much, y'all. That really meant like so much to me for y'all to stay and stick it out with me and not you know uh, hang up the towel. Um, and even if y'all did, like I wouldn't, you know what I'm saying. But thank y'all so much. Y'all really g'd it out with me and stuck by my side till one o'clock, one thirty in the morning, baby. Thank you so much. I love y'all. Have a great day, great night, wherever you are in the world. I hope you are blessed and at peace in your life. Stay blessed, guys. I will see y'all Freestyle Friday for another great set. I love y'all. Good night, good night, good night. Peace. Oh, Thank you.
Emmanuel, stop, I'm recording.
Thank you. 